Guapos y guapetes, gente hermosa, ¿cómo estamos? Este día tan bonita del... <risa> no es de la isla, es del, uh, del mundo. ¿Cómo va? ¿Qué haces tú? I'm walking again, look. Walking, walking. Eh, casi 28 kilómetros hasta, hasta ahora y 6 más hasta San Clemente. Y mis pies también. Oh, dolo, 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 dolo. oh mira. Oh, that's good. That's another straight line then. I'm fortunate. Thank you, universe. Oh, today's been really challenging. Eh, tengo un retos grande hoy. Porque el sol, yo no sé. Porque, mira, totalmente, totalmente, totalmente con los chemtrails. After we saw the tornado thing before. All these chemtrails just appear from everywhere. And they've totally taken over the entire sky. I've been watching them all day. I'm going over here. And... I don't know if they've affected my mood. These are chemicals, these are nanomaterials that they put in the sky and they just agreed, just confirmed it in Spain that yeah, we're doing it, so what? What? What do you mean you're poisoning us? What do you mean you're poisoning everything? Um, we don't know why it is uh, that they're blanketing the sky with all this. And uh, it's got to have an effect on us in one way or another. Uh, there's a lot of theories behind why. It's been going on for many, many, many years. And uh, some people think it's suppression of the soul, blocking the, uh, the connection to our spirit, to our souls. <laughs> um, I don't know. Oh, grass is very nice to walk on. But yeah, today's been a challenging day today because again, long straight lines, dusty roads. This is the first really different type of view that I've had walking through some grapevines, some great uh, vineyards in, uh, where am I? Casa de los Pinos, the house of the pines. And there are the pines over there. I've just walked through some as well. Uh, today's going to be my longest, longest day. I woke up with Ganas this morning um, and set off at a World record pace, four and a half kilometers per hour. I got to the midway point in three and a half hours and I was very tired. And then the 40 minutes that I sat down and had something to eat, the baguette flew. Why is that? Why is that? Why can't the walking bit fly and the resting bit take ages? Why do we do this? Why do we do this? Por qué haces esta? Why do we do this? I don't know. I haven't got all the answers. I haven't got any answers. All I know is that I'm going to sleep long and long and long and long and hard tonight when I get to the Alberg. And this is kind of... These roads are really challenging, look. It's just... It's not like nice walking. Like, here is okay, but it's challenging because it's on the sand. And then you've got all these stones this is the best bit, the grass. Well, the grass doesn't last very long because it's so thirsty, this place. And this is a bit I've been having to put up with and feeling like I'm not getting anywhere. Um, we have got some good news though. We've got some amazing photographs from the kids in Kabali. Isaac's been on the case yesterday and today uh, getting them involved, doing something. They've been dancing and they've been playing. It's so beautiful to see the big smiley faces on some photographs. And uh, on our little group, on the, uh, the campaign management group, we've got some videos that we're going to share with you later on as well. And I've not looked at them, but there's been some great feedback from campaign team, campaign manager, Carl Peachy, my little bro, and uh, social media correspondent and expert, Courtney Emily Peachy, my little peach. Um, both doing excellent jobs. Thank you so much. And Isaac doing an awesome job over there. Uh, once I've got to the hostel, this is going to be my road. Up with road, feet up, and watch the videos that Isaac sent through with the kids and the folks of Kabbalah. Um, he said he was going to send some videos through to us of support and this. So uh, I'm very excited for that. 
and like I say, we'll get them shared with you as soon as possible. I think I'm approaching 300 kilometers as well, yellow arrow, for the, uh, for the ride, for the walk. I realize that in my guidebook, <laughs> in the top right hand corner, it says how many kilometers I've done so far. And when I get to San Clemente, it's going to be 300.1 kilometers. I don't know if that deserves a rest. Maybe I put my feet up and stay off tomorrow um, because this one's been a tough one. I think there's another 26, 27 for the next stage as well. And maybe if I can get uh, the free hostel for one night, and maybe I can stay for two and be cheeky. Oh yeah, let's have a look. Don't forget, get sharing these posts, please. Get your people involved. Get your companies involved. Anyone that uh, has got a big heart, let's create this school and let's give these kids a beautiful presence, present of beautiful presence and an amazing future. Uh, this is what I want to do and this is what y'all want to do, otherwise you wouldn't be watching me, would you? Suffering. Suffering! I did this to me! I'm suffering! Ah!